This video is brought to you in part by SecondChanceGaming.com. They are a direct sponsor of me and this channel, and so if you want to indirectly support the channel while also buying or selling cards for your own matches, your own tournaments, your own duels, your own purposes, your own needs, then definitely check out their site and see what they have to offer you. I'm a big fan of how they do business, and their pricing and shipping from what I've seen and experienced thus far are both top notch. So definitely check out their site, which is linked in the description, and let them know that Phoenix sent you. But with that out of the way, let's get straight into the video. Hey, what's up guys? Phoenix here, and this video is going to be another Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro Duel video, and this time I'm going to be playing with the Phantasm Spiral Paleozoic deck, aka a pile of shit. Alright? Um, oh great! I drew set rotation with the Gateway of Chaos! Fucking fantastic! Look at this bull! Oh my god! I'm so agitated! Alright. Okay, well then. So, I have lost so much ranking with this shitty deck that I promised to play. The Phantasm Spiral deck is literally just garbage. There's no way that anyone can try to justify it as otherwise to me in any way, shape, form, or capacity. It's just absolutely trash tier. Nothing of redeeming value comes from this deck. Um, this is the Paleozoic version, which I've tried a few different variations of it. I've been playing this deck for literally hours in the Checkmate server. I was up in the 1780s category, and if you saw at the bottom of the screen, I am now in 1501. I've done nothing but lose games since I started playing this deck, and I've tried so many different variations. I've tried doing things with, um, I've tried doing things with, uh, with Carter Demise. I've tried doing all these other sorts of things, but this deck literally sucks because one, it can't go second, two, it's Phantasm Spiral. At least the Dino deck can go second because you're playing a shit ton of board wipes, you're playing strong normal summons. This deck's playing a fuck ton of trap cards. Um, so like it, it just becomes really hard. Now I'm losing to this. Oh baby. Um, this is this is becoming a problem. You should have well, I mean, if this is a mirror force, I mean I guess you're respecting that um, for the four hundred less damage, but Ideally, you want to just hit for the clean 5k and then summon this afterwards, but oh, yeah, you desire is into two settables. Great. Oh, I just, I need to film this. I need to get this out of the fucking way because I cannot, for the life of me, for the life of me, understand how people think that this deck and these decks are good. I can't. I cannot fucking believe it in any way shape or form I'm gonna activate this Rageki it's gonna get negated I'm gonna set Morelia it's gonna do nothing and I'm going to die next turn oh Imperial Order even better mate all right so now I don't <laughs> now he still has the toad all right fantastic look at this garbage look at this garbage all right I get for some reason I started I've gotten into this habit of clapping really really hard when I uh when I um, get angry and agitated with things that I don't want to be dealing with anymore. I'm about to lose more ranking to this bullshit, and I'm going to have to lose more ranking to it in the next video I play. God damn it. Oh, actual agitation. <laughs> agitation nation. Alright, so Toad attacking me directly. I'm losing this game this turn. Look at this fantastic thing. Like, I'm not, I'm going to use this. I'm going to use this because I've been doing nothing but sitting here and losing for the last two hours no matter what changes I make to the deck. And I just, I need to play it, I need to get it over with because this deck sucks dick and anybody that tries to sit there and tell me that Phantasm Spiral in any of its forms are good decks, I'm going to tell you good day sir because this deck is literally garbage. There is no way you can tell me that a shitty vanilla deck is going to be doing anything in the format. It's a vanilla deck that revolves around equip spells. You're going to steal some wins maybe here and there, but you're never going to win a match. You're never going to out Masterpiece. You're never going to deal with Zoo. You're never going to deal with any other bullshit because the deck is inherently flawed because it's a deck built around a goddamn vanilla monster. There's no way this could be decent or good. It looks good on, you know, the card design paper because they all work with each other, they all have the proper synergy, they all have the proper activation clauses, and all that sort of shit. But ultimately, I know there are going to be people in the comment section of this fucking video, specifically someone by the name of, like, Chimeratech Overdragon, who's literally just... I can't understand how the reasoning behind this person, like the arguments he presents, exist. I can't understand it because he literally just provides every reasoning of why the deck is good. He mentions cards that are not Phantasm Spiral cards, but are cards that can be played in 
than any other better anti-meta oriented deck like skill drain like anything else lose a turn all these things he's like you could play these cards it's like yeah i could play clee forts too at least that deck's better because scout is inherently better than the entirety of this fucking deck oh my god i'm actually just really mad that i've had to spend the last two and a half hours of my fucking life trying to play this deck, trying to learn how to play with it, only to realize that there's nothing to learn. The deck's just shit, and there's no way that you can fix shit. You cannot polish shit to be anything more than just, you know, at the end of the day, it's still a hunk of shit. <laughs> I can't believe that I've been wasting my time with this, and I'm going to be wasting my time for another video. I'm going to stop ranting right now before I get way too triggered and way too furious, and we're just going to end the video here. So anyway, as always guys, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe to all the nonsense you usually do. Links as always are in the description of my Facebook and Patreon pages. If you want to support the channel directly, then Patreon is the best way to do so. If you like the content that I've been producing and want to support the channel's growth and support my ability to make content, then even something as little as a dollar a day is a fantastic way to show your support, as well as opening up the Patreon feed to you to allow you to vote on other potential future upload schedules and things that I do. I've been doing, you know, I'm going to be starting to do that. I've already started doing that in fact and that is why these videos went in the past like week have gone up in the order that they went up and all that sort of stuff but other than that as always like this video if you want like the content that I've been doing and want to see more content like this definitely not more content of this deck because this deck sucks ass uh, but if you're new here consider subscribing if you already haven't and want to see more awesome Yu-Gi-Oh content obviously not this video because this video sucks because the deck that I'm playing sucks and there will be one more like it in the very near future so don't hold your breath for that one because ooh, it's coming Oh, baby, it's coming. But anyway, as always, thanks for watching, as I may have already said. Thanks for your time, as usual, guys, and take care. I'm going to go give myself a breather and then come back and lose more rating with this deck and checkmate server that I've spent a lot of time clawing up into so that I could play against competent people, okay? 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 Yes, let's continue with this thought process. Take care, guys.